a pharmacist speaks with a customer at Walmart, Neighborhood Market in Bentonville, Arc, in 2014. On Monday, Walmart introduced a new set of guidelines for dispensing opioid medications. Sarah Bentham, AP Hyde Caption, a pharmacist speaks with a customer at Walmart Neighborhood Market in Bentonville, Arc, in 2014. On Monday, Walmart introduced a new set of guidelines for dispensing opioid medications. Walmart announced Monday it is introducing new restrictions on how it will fill opioid medication prescriptions in all of its in-store and Sam's Club pharmacies. It is the company's latest expansion of its opioid stewardship initiative, intended to stem the spread of opioid addiction, prevent overdoses and curb overprescribing by doctors. It follows a similar initiative by CVS that went into effect in February. A March report by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention found overdoses from opioids soared by nearly 30% between 2016 and 2017. We are proud to implement these policies and initiatives as we work to create solutions that address this critical issue facing the patients and communities we serve, Mary Beth Hayes, Executive Vice President of Health. Over the next 60 days, the fourth largest pharmacy chain will cap acute painkiller supplies to cover a maximum of seven days. It will also limit a day's total dose to no more than the equivalent of 50 morphine milligrams. And, in states where prescriptions are restricted to fewer than seven days, Walmart will abide by the governing law. Walmart said the new policies align with the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommendations established in 2016. Those rules were meant for doctors prescribing chronic pain medication and encourage primary care physicians to prescribe the lowest effective dose Walmart opioid read full story more health.